Is that? No idea what I'm talking about. Do I particularly care, though, is the question. Well, considering the fact that you're the one started a conversation, and you always seem to be sad that you're missing out in the references. <laughs> I was wondering when somebody was going to do that. Okay. Anyway, I'll be back. Okay. Okay. I'm back for a second here. Did some spring cleaning. Uh, well, you could probably consider it fall cleaning, because it is fall. I've got the door all fancied up. Quite fancy. I'm gonna start cleaning up the area a little bit and start marking out areas to build. Move the bed over here. Got a good crafting station set up. A little fountain here so I have an infinite water supply. Yep. Gonna get this all set up. Gonna start some food production so I'm not starving constantly anymore and I can actually sprint. Gotta get a basic storage set up. And that'll be my basic base to begin with. Uh, and then I'll go ahead and start laying out where I'm gonna start building and all of the other blocks and things. Also, I'm going to get an aerial view of the map if I can. Probably just building straight up. Or climbing one of these waterfalls. That would work. Taking a picture from up there. So that way I can kind of draw it out in my head. Or in a... just on a piece of paper. So. Alrighty. Hello. Okay, so since my last recording here, I made a little bit of progress on the house and or the little hole here as you can see it's expanded it quite a bit we've got our storage room here which looks pretty nice kind of still very temporary Sorry at some point right now i'm playing world of tanks we've got hoova in the chat and mumble as well as tub uh we've got our chest here storing our books palmanomicon and some stuff i'm on a mission to get tub to play it'll he never happen like world of tanks which I raided from this village as well as the small smeltery, which I've got set up in the back room here. Here we are. And if you can hear that annoying noise, that is in fact the nether portal. You may be wondering where it is, I can easily show you. It's just around this way. Here's the farm. Got some Minicio plants started. A lot of wheat. I had to find some cows because I completely forgot we had the glove here. Dude, the T-54 first prototype is fun. You actually bought it? Yes. Hmm. Which I will harvest. Cause it's like the Super Pershing, easy. except with yet less useless armor and a better gun. And here's the nether portal. Our nether, on the other hand, is kind of not so fun. I have been there. I just got out of there last night and went and got some erudite and cobalt. Except in this match, where I am the lowest ranked tank at tier 8. And I will There are five the tier tens on both teams, four tier nines on both teams. And I'm the lowest. <laughs> Man. Um, I inadvertently made a door you cannot leave. There we go. So we've got this area here, and then if you head out this door, we have my torch trail. Which will lead you all the way to a nether fortress all the way out this way. Which doesn't seem like a whole distance, but in the nether Have you guys really seen is. the newer um, episodes of South Park, like from season 15 onwards? No, not really. You have to be more specific. 
Well, I was just gonna say that, like, place. they take in, uh, every now and then, they focus on Kenny and his family, and holy shit, he's like the best brother ever. Oh, uh, we also found another spider thing down... Where's it here? Down there. And I got, got a bunch of loot from that. Anyway, that's the base so far. I'll see you in a little bit. I still haven't climbed up the waterfall here and mapped up the area where everything's permanently going to be. And this is just a temporary base still. So, see you next time. Uh, what did I come back in here for? Oh, right, music. The jukebox is still just a chest with a diamond in the middle, right? I don't know, dude. Yes. You know, if you search this shit and click it, it'll tell you the recipe. You know, this is the only game with that kind of functionality that I recall off top hand. Uh, Seven Days to Die. Doesn't... Oh yeah, it does. <laughs> I haven't played Seven Days to Die in how long now? Uh, it wasn't that long ago, bro. Oh, it seems to be to me. Do you also have the memory of a fucking flea? I like my memory, thank you very much. No, I actually really don't. I hate my memory. I don't see how you still exist with your shitty memory. He's a goldfish. Even goldfish have better memory. You can train goldfish, you know that. I mean, you don't even have the excuse of, you know... What is going on in your background? <laughs> I have no fucking idea, but I hope they kill each other. <laughs> Tub procreated. That'd be scary. Tub will never procreate. There we go. Now I can listen to creepy ass music while I play game. There are chop trees. Spooky, scary skeletons. I'm pretty sure that's copyrighted. Um, most music is copyrighted, bro. I know. Start your lawnmowers. I don't wanna. My lawnmower started years ago. My lawnmower fell into a vat of acid and hence never come back out. Why would you do that to a lawnmower? I didn't do shit to it. It fell in on its own. Why was it near a vat of acid? Dude, I don't know. It got up and walked around on its own for a little while and then it got near my vat of acid for getting rid of bodies and it fell in. Look, you can't blame everything on me, fuck. No, oh, yes I can. I can doesn't mean it's true, though. Chests can't craft fucking chests. What? <laughs> I kept opening a chest because it's right beside my crafting bench. Hmm. And I needed the crafting bench to craft something. With specifically a chest. So chests can't craft chests. Okay, the music thing's still going on. I really wish I had found a different CD than that one. And I don't have one. There's no way to make them, are there? What? The discs. Make no, but you can take and uh, find a villager that has a record store. Elvis is like such a very freaking rare spawn, though. No, oh, yeah. If you want to get to the uh, mining world, use slash teleport space spawn. You got that done last night? Yep.
Have you built this? No, it just appeared on its own. Oh, neat. I need to get some signs up in this bitch. So wait, is this the... It is the mining world. Yeah, wait, you were being sarcastic by you building this. No, I built that place. Yes. So yes. It just spawned on its own. Holy shit, dude, did you... I didn't realize I was still in the same world. I thought I was in the, uh, the Domini dimension. Hmm. Looks a great wood tree. I'm actually gonna cut it down. Do you know there's a chest here, right? Never mind. Okay. Welcome back. So, we actually head back in here and sleep. If you didn't notice, I clear cut the area for the most part of trees so I can get a better look at the landscape. Going up on that island did not help because it's a giant cliff and I couldn't get a clear view. And yeah. So, going up there didn't help at all. Shit balls and save fire. Tubs in the nether, hurting himself, killing ghasts. Fun. And I don't think you guys have noticed what I've done. Maybe have. I went ahead and. I'll tell you what, I'm not going all the way back to my base just for a fucking transport locator. Okay. Went ahead and uh, organized the waterfalls here so they're actually less everywhere and they look a little bit better. So. That was pretty much the main update. Uh, the reason I didn't do a speed build of it or anything is because it was just me terraforming to kind of get rid of the need of. Or just to make it a little bit easier for me to get across the water and do skeletons. Because before, that entire side of the cliff was waterfall. And the skeletons would spawn up there, walk down the hill, and shoot me from this side while I was chopping the trees. It was annoying. Um, I've also decided that this here is where I'm going to put my main workshop. So, as I'm building that, I'll need to tear down my current one. I think there. someone's been near my pump and got something exploded off of it. Uh, Nox been in there, but other than that, I don't know. I haven't that seen your pump yet. Sucker. Wait, how do you know he's been near my pump then? No, I, I don't know if he's been near your pump. I know he's been oh. in the nether. Mill's currently doing something. I guess he's on the laptop or something and can't do mumble. So, uh, there's, when I do finally do the final version of these rivers and waterfalls and things, and I'll, and when I do the, like, actual speed run of it, speed build, I keep calling it speed run, I have no clue why, I'll go ahead and make this here into more of a river that's going to outlet into the ocean over there. Maybe build, like, a tunnel here that'll go through there and probably connect those two as well. Uh, the reason I haven't done that yet is because I haven't built any of the other buildings. I just want to get them more sorted out. Aside from that, that's pretty much all I've been doing today. I did grow a bit more of my crops here. Eat food and starving. There we go. And I think later on here... Oh, I made some tools. I made the snow shovel and the ice axe. Uh, both with shiny heads and... Th uh, not thalmium. But manilium tool rods. Done some crop or farming. Mostly uh, my wheat because I need more food. Although I think I've got that pretty well sorted out. I'm going to stop growing these carrots and slowly replace them with these Vinicio crops because they are more useful. We farmed. And now my next step is to get as many machines as possible. I'm going to make the rest of my tools here in a bit. Uh. Mostly shiny heads and stuff like that. I might go ahead and go a little bit into thong craft here and we do have that installed and get some uh, thalmium. Make thalmium bindings if I feel the need to. But aside from that, I think that's everything I've done so far today. As you can see, we've got a lot of wood. Tub did make the mining agent. You understand, Bob, on what used to be a lava lake, and then Tub Corp showed up, and it is now nothing but stone. We must all party. feel horribly for the lava, which is no longer here. Live reporting from uh, hell. 
Back to you, Bob. You know, they just make it so the lava generators and things like produce um, cobblestone. That's an excess waste. Because technically, you'd be getting rid of matter if you didn't other, or if you, if you didn't get anything out of it other than energy. Well, the whole theory about the magmatics and shit like that is you're just taking the heat. Yeah, that's why you should get a cobblestone uh, or something out of it as well. Like how the harvesters produce sludge, you should have. Yeah. Uh, so as that's trying to decide whether it should be cobblestone or whether it should be obsidian. Obsidian's more useful though. That'd be more like a product than a, a waste though. Let's see, that's just it. Obsidian is literally the only thing that comes from lava. You don't get stone from it, you get obsidian. No, you well, can also you get cool like, it, um... That's if you cooled off too quickly, though, is you get obsidian. IRL, anyway, in, in the game, if you put it next to water block, but... Hmm. Hmm. You could get smooth stone, but that's more of a product as well, because you could use it for building supplies and things. Cobblestone could, could be considered a product anyway. Well, less useful product. Dude, I use it all the time for my mines to shore up walls. True. In fact, I'm thinking about writing a program for my turtle to take in... Uh, to check the walls and if there's a fucking air block or a lava block or a water block there, he's gonna stick a piece of thingy in it. Okay, fall damage is still on. I just had a test to make sure gravity was still working. What, um, did you just jump out of a fucking window or something? <laughs> no, I jumped off a, a little uh, cliff thing that I thought should have hurt me from fall damage and it didn't so I went back up the cliff head and actually jumped off it with space and then it actually just to test to see if it actually was still working yeah anyway so that's been that so far let's go ahead and see what else I can get into here